giving us the soundtrack to our lockdown summer with Savage Love. Jason Derulo is back. He's got a new single. He's got a new video, Take You Dancing. And aside from a new single, Jason's been crowned the king of TikTok during lockdown, keeping his 34 million followers entertained with ridiculous challenges, sickly sweet recipes and celebrity hangouts, including <laughs> that teeth incident with Will Smith. Now, we've got a little technical difficulty with Jason. Is He's he there! He's there! Jason joins us now live from Los Angeles. Jason, good evening to you in LA. Hey, good evening, good evening. How are you guys doing? I've never good seen morning, my sir. co I've never seen my co-host Susanna more trembly with excitement <laughs> than she is this morning uh -huh. at you, the king of TikTok, <laughs> swaggering your way onto our screens. Can you say hello to Susanna? Hey Susanna, how you doing? Oh. <laughs> oh, oh. Is, is it, hey, how you doing? Is it just the way you say how you doing? Immediately, she's putting in your hands. It's great to see you, Jason. I, 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 I must confess to being slightly disappointed because we normally see you on TikTok with your fabulous, glamorous background, your fabulous house, your pool, uh, your girlfriend, and for some reason, we've put you in front of a black curtain. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> What's going on? You know what? I mean, yeah, we, I guess I guess it had to be really formal today. You yeah. know, we had to be, you know, it's morning time. We didn't want to give people a blast of color. <laughs> you know, I think even my, my hoodie might be a little much it this is. early in the morning. It you is. know what? We could never have too much early in the morning. It's, it's that kind of show. Jason, uh, can, Jason. I, can I ask you? Because I am obsessed with TikTok. I spend way too much time <laughs> lost Dang. in TikTok. Savage Love is probably the most played song on TikTok, everyone's done the video to it. Can you, but for many, many people, they still don't know the wonders of TikTok, except for the fact that President Trump says he wants it banned. So can you just explain what the TikTok phenomenon is? What is TikTok for old people like me? <laughs> Damn, if you don't know what TikTok is, that means you're old, but... um. <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you. I know that. I'm 55, mate. Me, You'll me, be 55 one day. That means, that means the kids might be too old. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> jokes, jokes, jokes. So um, TikTok is, is, is wonderful because it's a platform where uh, so many uh, different kinds of people can thrive, right? I mean, depending on what your interests are, you can thrive on this app because there's no rules. You know, if you like dancing, do that. If you like cooking, do that. If you like art, you know, whatever it is that you love, if you like fitness, anything can go viral tomorrow if it is entertaining or insightful enough. Um, so, you know, I think that's what makes it so cool. I mean, it, you know, everybody can kind of go on there and watch all sorts of things. And the algorithm can kind of guess what you like as, the you know, you, you uh, move through the app and click the like button yeah. um, it gets to know well, you. But that's sense. the problem. That is part of the problem, isn't it? Because President Trump and others are concerned that actually TikTok has so much information about who we are, what we like, all our personal details. I um, mean, like all of the other apps too? <laughs> well, I, but what do you think about the fact it might be banned, that President Trump might get his way because he's worried about the Chinese government knowing too much I about mean, us? I mean, I'm not going to get all political with it, but I mean, uh, at the end of the day, I think a lot of people would be very upset and um, and sad, you know, that yep. TikTok was gone. Um, but I don't think that's going to happen, honestly. It's just it's it's just embedded in in so many different cultures around the world. I, I just can't see it going away. Jason, and, uh, your, and I, your voice. There is something called VPN too. I think people would still use it. Jason, I want to talk to you about your voice because mm. I can immediately feel the seductive effect it's having on Susanna from <laughs> 6,000 miles away. Hey, listen, it's, it's late night over here. It's a different time for me. I already done, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You've got your late night <laughs> voice How on. successful has that voice <laughs> been in the art of seduction over the years? <laughs> I don't even know how to answer that, man. <laughs> it's, been, it's, it's worked well for me. Do you sing it's your working. own songs to, you know, as part of the wooing process? <laughs> I don't. I don't. <laughs> really? Because everyone I, else what does. What do you go for? A bit of Lionel Richie, a bit of Marvin Gaye? <laughs> you know what? Um, I'm, I'm a shuffle kind of guy, so like I'll, I'll put uh, Spotify on, sh on uh, either shuffle or I'll go to a playlist and like play whatever the playlist decides, you know? Um, I'm not very picky. Uh, when it comes to those times. Well, your you saw your song Savage Love, which, as I say, is the basically the background music to TikTok, uh, became the mm. global number one on Spotify. I think it's one of the most 
streamed pieces of music ever. If you put, you know, popular shuffle on Spotify, you're going to hear your tracks over and over mm -hmm. again, aren't you? It's a beautiful thing. It's 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 really exciting now, and especially with um you know the next song uh, take you dancing also, uh kind of you know taking taking like the same route. I mean it's it's really been incredible to watch because I was s signed to a record label um, for 12 years and I'm finally a free agent, um and being able to release these songs as a free agent and freely uh, release this music it feels really good because for a long time that's all I wanted to do is just release songs and. Um, you know, it was just a difficult situation with uh, the po politics where I was at. Jason, uh, LA right now must be a difficult place to be. I've got a house there, but I haven't been able to get back there since February. Uh, obviously, badly that, hit is by that how rich people talk. Yeah, I got a rich. <laughs> I, got, I got a house over there. I, I, I've never been there, but you know, yeah, I own, I, just I one of a handful of houses. I have a little, little holiday home world. in Beverly Hills, and occasionally, you know, from year to year, I might pop over. No, thumbs, normally, thumb. normally, I spend a lot of time over there, and I've not been able to, of course, because of coronavirus. But you're there. Badly hit by coronavirus, now badly hit by these ferocious heat waves that have come in yeah. the last couple of weeks. What's it been like in LA? Um, it's been it's been good from the perspective of losing weight. You know, if you want to lose a couple of pounds, you just sit outside for approximately 30 seconds. <laughs> Um, and you will come inside a little slimmer. So it's, that's been good. I need to get back to my house, right. then, I, by the sound of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's what, rough. It, I, it got to 120, um, I think, yesterday or the day before. I mean, that uh, today is unbelievably was, hot. Yeah. I, I know you guys do Celsius. I don't know what it was in Celsius. but I think it was 49, height. wasn't it? Just, just touching 50, which is ridiculous. Mm. Ridiculous. Um, Jason, you look in great shape. Uh, it's great to have you on the show. Have you got any other health and fitness tips for any of us who might have put on a few pounds in lockdown? Uh, absolutely. Put the cookie down. Damn, put the cookie down. Nah. Um, intermittent fasting. I feel I, seen. I feel like <laughs> no, <laughs> intermittent fasting. I swear by it. I mean, if you if you want to try it, I mean, it's uh, it's having sixteen hours of eating. I mean, sixteen hours of not eating. And then oh yeah, only intermittent fasting. Hours. Right, yeah, Jason. Yeah. Final <laughs> final request for you. Uh, a friend uh -huh. of mine got my favorite ever footballer to give me a birthday video, and she's just messaged me. Oh my God, Jason Derulo. I don't know what's going on here, but there's a lot of excitement. Mm. Please get him <laughs> to say hi. Such a huge fan. Can you just say? Hi, Elise Dunweber. It will, because it'll get me Elise more football Dunn videos. Weber? Elise Dunweber. Just say hi. That's what we got to do. Yeah. Hey, Elise. How you doing? <laughs> Good morning. You know what? That's enough. That, yeah. That'll be enough. I'll get more football videos that way. So it's, it's like a quid pro quo. Uh, Jason, also, you get twice as much for your money because your daughter's called Elise. My, you, my you daughter's called Elise, so I can pretend it was for her as well. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's, a, it's a win win for everyone. The new Jason, single, what a pleasure. The new what a single pleasure. is Take You Dancing. It's just as brilliant as, as all your, the rest of your fabulous music. Thank you so much for keeping our spirits lifted through a difficult time. And nice to find that you're just a cool guy in real life as well. And not one of those <laughs> jumped up, that. you know, people in the business we all know who are all. Awful. Yeah. So thank you. I love it. Jason Derulo's <laughs> rider was praise, just give me a black curtain. Give Susanna one last burst of that <laughs> voice. Come on. Oh yeah, please. Sorry? Give Sa Susanna a last burst of that voice. Oh yeah, I'm wishing you a very, very happy morning oh, and amazing gosh. rest of your day. <laughs> well. <laughs> all right, it's not just Susanna that's forced right. <laughs> Jason Derulo, that's enough of that. You're driving all the women wild here. Yeah. Uh, great to talk to you, man. That all made up for them put the cookie yeah. down. Uh, Jason Derulo, great to see you. Calm down.